day 50 of quarantine. I'm seated at my home work setup. But yeah, this is where the magic's gonna be happening for the next couple weeks until we get out of this. I hope everybody out there is staying safe. Hello everyone, just checking in real fast to let you know that I'm doing as well as I can be under the circumstances. After all, you know me to be a pretty pragmatic person, and so, before this calamity struck us all, I spent much of my time and money investing in stockpiling provisions. Not provisions for my belly, but provisions for my eyes and for my mind, in the form of 3D Blu-rays. Hello everyone, um, how are things up in the surface world? Um, I have taken uh, social distancing a little bit more uh, serious than some of the other people uh, around me, or should I say, no longer around me. I have barricaded myself in this lovely fallout shelter. Um, this is something I had been constructing for the last uh, 18 years in case something like this happened, and so I am glad it's coming into use. I hope to hear more from all of you soon. Hello, outside world. It is quarantine and I'm just arriving at work. And this is where I spend all of my time. First things first, gotta get a sniff of that fresh outside air. Oh, that's nice, okay. Hey guys, it's your boy John Smith here. Day nine of the quarantine. I really gotta say, I'm, I think I'm reaching my limit. As per the demands of the quarantine, I have not left my bed for nine days. Um, I've also been wearing all this protective gear to protect my skin. I feel like it's, it's overkill, but that's what the mayor said to do, so that's what I'm doing. Hmm. 275 days until Christmas 2020, as of this recording. Working from home with a baby, day uh, 600, 600 and something. So this is quarantine life, working from home. Um, you know, getting ready to record another video, gameplay with John. That should be fun. Um, here's a thumbnail I made yesterday, and Adam said, this is the worst thumbnail I've ever seen, you're trash at your job. I'm just kidding, he didn't say that, we just wanted a different one. But maybe we can use this for something else if you want to see sneak peek. This is the thumbnail I made, and so Lisa's the godmother. So here we are in quarantine. Yeah, I see more. And life has given us lemons. See what that means. So I'm just gonna show you guys my new office setup, uh, starting with my workstation. And because my phone is uh, acting weird, this is what I'm gonna have to do. So this is my setup. This is where I make my music and also do my edits. And who knows? I have all this time on my hand now. Maybe I'll finish dick in a blender. One of the largest, most comprehensive and superior collections in this or any other universe. Staying safe, staying, staying clean. They're weathering the storm. Ha <laughs> ha. Isn't that right, Barry? It's not your banana. Eh. Uh, this is this is the nursery slash office, and uh, this is what I deal with. I make it a point at least once a day to peruse my collection in order to raise my joy. I will simply run my fingers along the spines of these cinematic masterpieces, arriving at a randomly chosen picture. Ah, Skyscraper 3D, there it is. I'm moving soon, so my life has just been packing and 
uh, editing and thumbnails, <laughs> really great thumbnails, and uh, Animal Crossing. It's nice because my desk is right next to the kitchen so I can snack all day. It's not as long as a walk as it usually is in our office. Uh, I'm not wearing any pants, just have this blanket for modesty. Uh, blanket's a little hot. Almost all my snacks are gone. I'm just down to the candy. And uh, my bedpan has, has been full for a few days now. Hello again, everyone. Uh, James here from the uh, fallout shelter underneath the ground. Um, I just wanted to report in and say that I am still doing quite well. I have several um, more months worth of food. Unfortunately, the heater has failed. It failed very, very quickly. So it's gotten quite cold down here, but that's all right. I have plenty of layers, and uh, I'd rather be cold than getting anyone sick or getting sick myself. So uh, stay safe, and we'll hear from you soon. <sighs> Oh no, how do I do it so I don't see myself? <laughs> Marley was dead, to begin with. There is no doubt whatever about that. The register of his burial was signed by the clergyman, the clerk, the undertaker, and the chief mourner. Scrooge signed it. This is my dog, Oreo, who drives me absolutely insane every single day. Oreo, do you want to show them how annoying you are? Oh, okay, never mind. I tried taking a sponge bath, but I just got my mattress all wet. <laughs> and now, now it smells all moldy. What are you doing, Serafina? Why? I did it here. You did it. Uh, home gym. I'm kind of the fitness guy at Funhouse, so it's important that I have this. I like to perfect my routines, and then I just, you know, send them along to James. Comic collection. Must have. I uh, haven't seen anybody that I know in like two weeks because I don't live with anybody right now. About to live with somebody, but right now I live alone. So <laughs> it's fine. I'm fine. But the main thing I do every day and now my new a lot of free time is I've been going out here on my balcony and I'm not stunting because yes, I do have a pool. But the most important thing I'm doing is I'm trying to figure out, is it possible for me to jump from here into my pool and not die? Hello everyone. Uh, this is an update from James in the shelter. Uh, we were attacked. They took, they took our, our clothes and most of, most of our food. And, um, I don't know how much longer we'll be able to last down here. Morale is low. I feel there's a mutiny coming. There's no mutiny! Yes, there is. And I worry that I'm starting to go a bit insane. But I'm holding out hope. See you next time. Allow me to evaluate this cover for you, okay? I'm gonna have to ding them. I'm gonna ding them a little bit on the cover. I feel like they got the cover art right, the image is right. Here you see the rock hanging off of the skyscraper, the city far below him. But it makes you wonder, why couldn't Universal have loosened their purse strings, spent the little extra dough in order to get the holographic lenticular cover? Wouldn't that have been a more powerful effect if you would see the bulging Johnson hanging from the building high above the looming city below, I think that would have been a bit more powerful. <laughs> Hi.
I'm very lucky that I have my own desk mate. He's over there. He's playing Animal Crossing. Um, I'm still working, still working at this time, but some people are playing, are in fact playing Animal Crossing. <sighs> uh, but yes, the quarantine affects us all very differently, as you can see. Please bury them, please don't hurt me. I've got work to do. No, no, die your claws. Be gentle, Barry. But the wisdom of our ancestors is in the simile, and my unhallowed hands shall not disturb it, or the country's done for. You will therefore... But, you know, I've been playing a lot of video games, so that's pretty cool. And I've watched a ton of movies. <sighs> Mostly rom-coms. I think by the time this quarantine is over with, I will find that out. And if you never see me in another video again, you know that it went terribly wrong. <laughs> I died. <laughs> As for the movie itself, I don't remember it too well. I was kind of in and out of consciousness when I was viewing it. I remember waking up on my couch several times and being surrounded by glowing embers, beautiful red embers floating in the air all around me. There must have been a scene with a lot of fire in it. And for that reason, I liked it. And for that reason, I highly recommend it. This is a good picture, okay? Hey everybody, James here for the final update. This message serves as my last will and testament. I don't think I have much longer to survive. My vinyl records. I'm leaving to Benson. If you're still out there, little boy, please enjoy them. To the Tampa Bay Dolphins Society for the preservation of small mammals and, and ocean life. I'm leaving my finest China. And to you, to. And my copy of Brutal Legend, I want to give it back to Tim. Tim, please take it on my behalf. I didn't realize you were going to take the thing down. Yeah, but I was doing a whole like I was doing a whole fallout thing. It was like so many parts and stuff. I, I changed I changed my hair like four times. That's the joke. Is it your hair's different? Well, it's one of the jokes. It's like a transition of time thing. running so deep. And the trees in the coom keep the stars in the sky well hid from the stream. As the stones in its bed wash the water and by. I wonder who Tune to the creaky old beach and the oaks. Not 
the pipe as they wave gently to the bright moon. On the creaky floor behind the wooden door of your bedroom. L cut. Great. Another perfect cut, Ryan. Mwah. Oh, hey, how's it going? I didn't see you there. How's my quarantining going? It, it's going okay. On the bright side, I've gotten to work on my chess game a lot. So far, I've beaten myself 50 times, and then myself has beaten me 50 times. So we've got quite an exciting tiebreaker coming up. I've been working on my guitar. Oh, wow! Get down with it, man. Been catching up on some reading I wanted to get done. I ran out of toilet paper on the first day, but luckily since the economy is crashing, all my money is worthless, so I've just been using that. I want to get a haircut, but I don't want anyone to touch my head, so I guess I have long hair now. I definitely have not been fucking that mannequin. And every day from 1 to a little before 101 in the afternoon, I make sure to go out and get my exercise routine in. I don't want to lose the tiny, pathetic muscles I still have. You know, I even made some new friends along the way. Are you, are you fucking coughing in your hand? Dennis! So yeah, in short, it's been pretty boring over here. Quarantining kind of sucks, and coronavirus can eat my taint. I'm gonna get back to this GTA. I got some important work to do. So, uh, y'all be safe out there, alright? See ya.